Hey guys, what's up? This is White Boy for the win, and welcome back to Why Mega Evolve. Now, earlier last week we talked about Mega Noivern, and today we're going to be talking about Mega Halucha. But before we get started, let me just give you guys a brief explanation of what this series is about. Now, every week we'll be picking two Pokemon that either need a Mega Evolution, deserve a Mega Evolution, or I want a Mega Evolution 4. Now, this is based off my opinion, my opinion alone, and no one else's. Now, if you guys do not like my opinion, then please. Post your own opinions in the comment section down below about what would you keep, what would you change, and etc. And at the end of every video, I will be telling you guys which Pokemon we're going to be talking about the following day. So with that said, here is Mega Halucha. Now, it may not seem like it for you guys, but it's been a while since I've recorded a Y Mega Evolve episode. Now, I've just been busy with school and with like the upcoming surgery of someone having in my family. I've just been very crazy, crazy busy, and I'm actually glad that I pre -recorded, recorded and bulk recorded a lot of my Y Mega Evolve videos, and I still have a couple that you guys uh, are technically supposed to be watching uh, that are not out yet, including uh Neuvern, considering that I'm pretty much recording on the day of like the actual surgery and I had pretty much a lot of my Y Mega Evolve videos pre-recorded until like the beginning of June and obviously Halucha is at the beginning of the June but regardless and besides the point um, I really been wanted to talk about Halucha for a while considering that when 6 Gen was first introduced I, I really didn't like Halucha all that much but then while actually trying to use Halucha it kind of grew on me about like actually liking its design actually using it a lot in battle I actually used this in a let's I want to say a let's play but like a gameplay on my uh, Y version and I just really really love Halucha. I love its typing. I love everything about it but the sad thing is is that to me Halucha looks like it should get like another evolution and then a mega evolution because something is missing uh, for Halucha. so I think another evolution plus a mega evolution would do it some good but regardless right now uh, since Halucha doesn't have an evolution of any sorts whether it's baby or just another evolution uh, I think a mega evolution would be a beneficial for it so that's why we are talking about Halucha. now as you can tell from what I've done to its stats I did increase everything and honestly everything needed to get increased so first things first um, for its physical attack I increased it from base 92 to base 130 now Halucha is obviously a physical attacker so obviously I wanted to increase its physical attack sky high to base 130 I mean it gets access to a quite a few variety of moves like high jump kick I believe jump kick as well uh, brave bird sky attack uh, poison jab u-turn rock slide stone edge just a lot of good variety of like physical type moves so at base 130 it's just gonna be wrecking shop and also uh, it gets access to home spots so you can run home spots on your hollow as well if you do decide to run it like that so uh, base 130 it's very very good now for its special attack I increased from base uh, 74 to base 85 now you're probably wondering why I increased its special attack now Halucha I believe does get access to focus blast so you can run like a mixed Halucha if you wanted to I mean it's not necessarily that you're probably are going to be running a mixed Halucha but there are some people who like to run crazy sets as well I mean I've seen some people run like a physical Gengar a physical Alakazam just Pokemon that don't really work for it they usually run just to be like having fun with it because Pokemon is all about fun it's not supposed to be all that competitive you know even though there is a competitive aspect to it so I think with just a smidge of increase with special attack um, there are going to be people like uh, or I should say people are going to be using like focus blast or, or any pretty much any special move along the lines of that on a Halucha just to be fun uh, so that's why I increased its special attack to base 85 now its defenses are pretty much Halucha is a glass cannon I mean with base 75 and base 63 for its physical and special defense it's not going to be living pretty much any hit so I want to give it a good bulk to its defenses as well now for its physical defense I increased it from base 75 to base 86 now I know it's not as high as its special defense obviously once we get there to uh, get there to uh, explain it in a sec but uh, with base 86 and physical defense it's not that it's not as high as I would like it to be it's just that 
it's not supposed to be like a defensive Pokemon. It's supposed to be a very fast, like hard hitting Pokemon and then pretty much dying in a couple of turns. So it's not likely that its physical attack or physical defense needs to be very sky high. It's pretty much supposed to be made for a glass cannon. So with base 86, I mean, it is some like somewhat of a increase uh, or some more bulk to its physical defense. So base 86 isn't actually all half bad. Now for its special defense, I increased it from base 63 to base 93. Now, the one thing I really wanted to do was increase the special defense by 30, um, and that's a lot of points to actually distribute into one stat that really doesn't benefit as much as its other stats, but uh, nonetheless, uh, I wanted to increase it to base 93 because pretty much every time when uh, you go up like against a Halucha, you're most likely going to be using like Thunderbolt, Ice Beam, or whatever the case may be, it's just like a, some sort of special like hard hitting move. So with a base 93 in special defense, it will be able to probably take hit like a special hit a little bit better than it would have just at base 63 because honestly let's be real now it's literally going to be uh one it's pretty much going to be one shotted if you use it in like without like a focus sash or anything like that so with base 93 i think it's actually a very good um stat to actually be at for a Mega Halucha. Now for its speed, I increased it from base 118 to base 128. I honestly didn't want to increase it all that high considering it's already high at base 118 as it is. So with base 128, it's still going to be really, really fast. So it's not likely, it's not like it's not going to be outspeeding anything. So with base 128 speed, it's still going to do its job. Now with a regular Halucha, it's base stats at 500, and with the Mega Evolution, it's going to be at 600. Now for its ability, I actually gave it a new ability called Spirit Chant. Now you're probably asking, what does Spirit Chant do? Now, Halucha is based off of a Luchador, if you cannot tell by the name, Halucha Luchador. I mean, they sound the same, and obviously it is like a rest. it's a wrestler that has a mask. So it reminds me of... Uh, that one cartoon with the lucha doors I, I can't remember what it's called but that's what halucha reminds me of so what spirit chant does is that pretty much it's like it's like sturdy that you can live at one hp but it actually doubles sturdy if that makes sense so pretty much if you're at one hp then you survive with sturdy and then with spirit chant you actually survive uh, or, or you're able to take another hit at uh four uh sturdy pretty much it's pretty much having a like two sturdies at the same time but it doesn't really like reset uh, after every turn so like for instance if your opponent goes for like ice punch and you lose one of the sturdies it doesn't reset back to do you're still going to be um at like one more like like one more sturdy if that makes sense and then once your opponent hits you again then you're pretty much going to die next turn if you pretty much do not knock out your opponent's pokemon so if that doesn't make sense i'm sorry me pretty much spirit chant is a double sturdy now why i've given it that ability is pretty much like i said halucha is based off of a luchador and when it comes to like like a uh, like wrestling pokemon uh you're like 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 imagine you're in the audience and you're rooting for like your favorite wrestler your favorite fighter or whatever the case may be you want them to win so like when they're about to die, like lose you cheer for them as like uh, as loud as you can for them to get back up so that's what spirit chant would pretty much like reminds me of or what halucha reminds me of it reminds me of like a wrestler obviously since it is based off of a, of a wrestler just to keep getting back up and never giving up so that's what spirit chant does it's pretty much like i said having a double sturdy now for its typing, I left it alone as fighting flying, because this is pretty much one of the best like typings in the metagame or just in the game in general. Uh, it's pretty much, I think, the first fighting and flying Pokemon. So I really love the typing on Halucha. So I just just decided to leave it alone as fighting flying. So with that, there is Halucha. So anyways, um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button. Also, don't forget to comment and subscribe. Now I'm sorry if I didn't like pretty much under or explain like its ability all that well just think of having a double sturdy but it doesn't reset after your opponent hits you um it's just that if your opponent hits you twice when you're at one hp the next turn or should i say the third turn you're pretty much going to get knocked out if you get hit again so uh that's what pretty much spirit chant does uh but like i said um thank you guys so much for watching if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to hit that like button also don't forget to comment and subscribe now i'm just going to be both recording a lot because i just 
really need to get into the grinded things again because it's been a while since I've uploaded or recorded a Y Mega Evolved video for myself. I mean, uh, you guys are probably watching this on June 2nd, if I'm not mistaken. So, uh, just, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm looking, I just need to get like back into the grind. But nonetheless, uh, the next Pokemon we're gonna be talking about is Mega B Barrel. So yes, we are actually gonna be going back to fourth gen because just just I really want to talk about Mega B Barrel because B Barrel is like one of those underrated Pokemon where everyone makes fun of and then they're gonna say, oh Badoo Fasoon Ubers. I mean and there's that been that joke for like years now. So I'm gonna be talking about Mega B Barrel on Friday. So with that, like I said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and also don't forget to comment and subscribe. So this is White Boy for the win, and I'll catch you guys later.